Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're learning about how to name a whole number in words. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help, you use Minute Math. There are, well, infinitely many whole numbers out there, and this is just one of them. And we're going to name this in words. We have 8, and then 165, 432, 0, 9, 8, and 710. And you can see we have sections of three separated by commas that really break it down. We have the one section here, and then these are like the, the, the thousands, and this is the millions. We got billions and trillions right there. When you name numbers, well, in words, we start with the most left value here, and that's going to be the 8. So if we start here with 8, we got an 8 there, but we, like I said earlier, it's in the trillions section. And we only have one of them there, so this is 8 trillion. And then what's next? We have 165, so we will write that. 100, 65, oops. I almost wrote five, five with a V. But like I said, we're in the, well, that was trillion, this is the billions here. So 165 billion. Now we go to the next section here, 432. And judging by this, I'm gonna write it down here just so we have more space here, but it'll all be one big word. So we have four, four in the hundred, so 400 in that little section, 30, 2, and then that's in the million. So we have million here. So 432 million. Now going down here, we have, well, there's a zero, so don't worry about that. And this one we call 98. So 98 here. And then that's going to be in the thousand section. 98,000. And then lastly here, we're just like in the basic numbers, really. We would call that just seven, right? Seven. And the hundred. And then we have one zero at the end, which we call ten. And there we have it. If we write this in words, we have our parts. Eight trillion, one hundred sixty-five billion. 432 million, 98,710, or 710. I always have the and, but it's just 710. Well, I hope you learned something here on how to name a whole number in words. If you did, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.